What's going on everyone? Welcome back. Today we are in Odessa, Florida and we are currently standing inside of a gorgeous home by Taylor Morrison. So let me take you outside and I'll tell you all about it. So this is the Farnese, Farnese, Farnese. It is, as toured, it is a two bedroom, two and a half bath. It's 2,100 square foot. It does have a two car garage right here. And this one by far is my favorite one that I've toured so far today and they are all amazing. So that's really saying something. This one has such a cool kind of Florida vibe, I guess, to it. Really nice. The color palettes inside of this home are just extraordinary. Like, I don't know, it just came together. The sky just is rocking it today. It's just making everything perfect. So super excited to share this home with you. Another nice little pool area this home is and all of the homes if you are a person that likes hosting these homes just i mean they're amazing and they're perfect for it so you do have like i said the pool area hot tub uh perfect place to come outside and grill and just kind of hang out this home is inside of uh, the starsky ranch community which there's like a bunch of different uh, neighborhoods within this community so I think Taylor Morrison builds several different or inside of several different communities here um, I personally will get to be touring two different communities uh, so hopefully that'll bring you uh, you know several different styles to check out but I mean this one I wasn't quite sure how I was gonna feel about it but once you like walk inside and stuff I was done, loved it. So coming back around to the front, see if we can squeeze through here. Again, you do have the two car garage right here. I'll try and get you in there. All these are display models. I mean, there's really no need for a driveway if it's just a model. It's just a place for people to come and, you know, pull different ideas so they can design their own home. So, but get a load of this. This is what you were greeted with when you first walk inside. I'll go ahead and turn you around real quick. So this is your foyer. Immediately, you have a tray ceiling, beautiful chandelier, gigantic doors. And then, now this home can be a three bedroom, uh, three and a half bath, I believe. So this room right here could be one of the bedrooms, but here it's set up as an office and this sits right up at the front of the house. So really pretty. I've loved all the decorating here too. It's been nice. Cute little bench area. And then your French doors that come in here. Snazzy. All right, so we got a, this is kind of a, a long narrow home. So we're gonna go ahead and hit everything I wouldn't say long and narrow, but everything just kind of flows from front to back on this one. So across the hall from the office, you do have this linen closet, and then you come to the first of the two bedrooms that we will be seeing on this tour. And it does have its own ensuite. So very nice. And then the closets here, Oh, they're locked in this one. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> uh, I don't know what I'm doing. So nice step-in closet here. And then into the ensuite, you have your single vent, single vanity, your vanity light, your toilet, and your shower and tub combo with the tile surround. And then you do have a linen closet in here also. One of the cool things that I like about all the staging in, in these homes that I've been touring today is that they have decorations in the closets. So I know immediately what it is. I don't have to be like, well, this could be, you know what I mean? But anyway, and then towards the back of the house, we're working our way back towards the garage right now, which is this door. Um, but to the right, you have your laundry room, 
your wash basin, and then you have all of the cabinets, and then your washer and dryer hookups. Of course, washer and dryer are here currently. And then you have your furnace on the opposite side of your countertop space. And then back behind that, you have vents and stuff. And then across the hall, you have your half bath with a pedestal vanity. And then your toilet opposite that. And then through this door is your two car garage. It's probably gonna be dark in here. Hopefully you can see it, but you know, it's a two car garage. Some of them have had lights on. I'm not going too far into that because these guys, you know, all these different home builders in the models and stuff, the garages tend to be where everything is stored. So if you wonder why I don't ever go in them, <laughs> that's why. So this is your actual formal dining room area. Again, tray ceiling. It's just crazy chandelier, love it. But all of this is broken up and away from like your kitchen area and everything. So just super cool. And then from there around the corner, you come into your kitchen area, your living room area, and then you have another little eating space towards the back for like breakfast and stuff. So we'll go ahead and get into the kitchen. Nice big stainless refrigerator. Got your refrigerator on one side and your freezer on the other. And then you have some counter space right off the bat with these beautiful gray cabinets. They got the nice pools, little stainless pools. And then the cabinets all the way around don't quite go all the way up to the ceiling, but and then you have your pantry. See what I'm saying? I don't have to guess that it's a pantry because there's food there. Anyway, and then onto the main cook surface of your kitchen. You have your gas stove, microwave, and then again, all of the cabinets. And you do have nice crown molding going all the way throughout too, which I think goes pretty much throughout the whole home. And then opposite your stove area, you have a huge oversized island, stainless dishwasher, lovely stainless undermount sink, and then plenty more cabinets and drawers. Now, the main cabinets were all gray. These are all kind of like an off-white almost. So you got yourself a two-toned kitchen. And then on the opposite side of the island, you have plenty of room for seats. Oh, and you even have some more storage up underneath of here. I'm not gonna, I thought, I was hoping they had wheels, but you know, more cabinet space on this side, so. And then nice pendant lights. And then right off of the kitchen, you have another little breakfast eating area. The really cute light fixture. And then from there, you come into your main living room with the coffered ceilings, beautiful light, and then a nice big space to mount your TV. And then you have these huge sliding glass doors. Let's see if we can get out here. Oh, it's over here. The first one I tried to do this, I had to like work at it. It's like, how do I get out of here? But I think all three of these slide all the way open. So you just have plenty of room. All right, so you do have a built-in grill area with a prep sink, refrigerator, and then of course the grill itself. A fun little hangout sitting area. You got the gas fireplace down here, little TV. That's nice. 
And then you do have an outdoor eating area and then several different places to kind of just hang out over here in the corner. And then if you wanted to catch some sunshine, you got this corner over here too. And then you have your pool and your hot tub. All right, y'all continue with the tour. I'm gonna go hang out. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I wish it worked that way though. Y'all come back and get me when you're done. I'm just kidding. I don't want to miss anything either. All right. So, and then off of the main living area, coming around the corner, you enter into the master bedroom. Wow. Very nice. Lovely bed, lovely light fixture. And you kind of got this little bay window area. So very nice tray ceilings. And then from there you come into your ensuite. You got the double vanities. Really nice countertop. Like this thing is. This is my favorite bathroom so far. And then coming into your shower, it kind of got this little drop down area. And then you have your rainfall shower head, normal shower head, and just tile everywhere. Got a little bench in the back right there. And then you have your water closet with a pocket door right here, dividing the space. And then you enter into the master closet. So beautiful wood built-ins everywhere. And then you do have up above us, you have access to the attic also. Really nice. All right, let me know what you think about this home down in the comments. If you want any more information on this model or Taylor Morrison, I'll leave that information for you down in the description. If you want to check out another one of Taylor Morrison's beautiful homes, go ahead and click on this video right here. And as always, guys, thanks for hanging out. My name's Timothy, and I'll see your beautiful face in the next one.